babies. How are, you, how are you doing today? Yay! Yeah, yeah. Good. Daddy is looking at the National Geographic Mega Crystal Growing Lab. Yeah! Grow eight amazing crystals and then make them glow. You guys want to do it today? Yeah! Yeah! yeah. All right. Come play with me, friends. Oh, okay, so we've got cups. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, so here are our samples. Oh, so we do get five. We do get uh, five genuine gemstone specimens in here as well. And this looks like the bag with those, but they are a little dusty. We may have to, uh, we may have to give them a quick cleaning and then we'll show you what they are. Comes with a little magnifying glass. Oh, man. So that we can examine the crystals. Shorty, can you hold that, please? We have looks like a tongue depressor, probably for stirring up the crystal mixture. Shire, can you hold on to that, please? We have five or four rubberized kind of mixing, like mixing vessels. Okay. Got. Oh. It also comes with a base. A base. And it looks like rocks, and there's little LEDs at the bottom, so that when you're done growing your crystals, um, when you're done growing your crystals, you can actually turn this base on, and they will light up. Okay. So it kind of looks like a nice rock base as well. Looks kind of neat. Okay. It also comes with. Oh, neat. Okay. Caution, experiment in progress, okay? It looks like these are actually places where we can actually put the crystals. They actually actually fold out into, into like a box. And then I think you can put your crystals in here when they're growing because it's gonna take them a little while to grow, okay? That's kind of neat. Okay, uh, these are the uh, Growing Lab instructions. Okay, Growing Lab instruction manual. Definitely gonna, definitely gonna need that. Okay, that's kind of neat. All right. It's the power supply for the base. Some more warning labels. Friends, are you ready to mix the crystals? Okay, so let's go for it! Alright friends, here's what we're going to do. we got a pot of boiling water here. What we're going to do is we're going to take the water, we're going to pour it into... Shorter, shorter, get back. We're going to pour it into our silicone funnel. Oh, you can see the steam there, it's very hot. Okay, we pour and pour, 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 pour. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more, and stop. Okay, now, all right, we'll put this aside. Now what we do, we take our crystal growing powder, which has a bunch of different chemicals in it. We pour that, we're gonna pour that into the Hot. boiling water. And then I can mix it. And then Shire will mix them, mix them, mix them, until it we cannot mix them, mix them anymore, okay? It too. So Shire? Yeah! Okay, I'm gonna throw a little bit in. Shorter, stay back. Okay. Shire, go ahead and mix them, mix them, mix them. Just a little bit. Oh, I mix. Oh, it feels a little bit hot. Oh, okay. The steam feels a little bit hot. A little bit more. What color is it, Schroeder? Green! I guess we should figure out what a crystal actually is. Bye. Here, Shire, I'm going to pour a little bit more. That's interesting. Okay, you keep stirring. Now, by definition, a crystal is a solid structure formed when atoms or molecules line up in a regular three-dimensional pattern. The salt on your dinner table, the only mineral we actually ingest in its rock form, the snow on the ground and the diamond in a wedding ring, they're all crystals. They're all crystals. The actual word crystal comes from the Greek word, Greek word yeah. chrysos, meaning ice cold. Ice cold. 
And what's cooler than being cool? That's gold. Okay. okay. Oh, our kit also came oh, with different fun. styles of crystals. So this is a geode. Oh, this is Kind of cool, huh? Some rose quartz. quartz, some fluorite, which is kind of a, which is kind of a milky green color. That's kind of neat, huh? There's amethyst. There's some amethyst, which is purple, which is on the floor. And we're okay, gonna take our seed rock. Seed Can rock. I feel it? No. What does it feel it's, like? It is like sand. Sand. Okay. Now let's we put take it. In. it. We take it. Get back, get back. And then we mix it? Nope, we don't mix it. All we do is we take it and go. Nope. And I make sure, oh, we gotta make sure that it's flat side oh. down. down. Okay, it's flat side down now. And now we wait seven to 10 days for the actual crystals to grow. Okay, so the crystals are going to start growing on that seed crystal that we put into the mixture, but it takes a very long time to grow a crystal. Seven to 10 days. Seven to 10 days. Oh, I'm sorry, okay. we have three more to do. We will do three more, and we will check every day to see what has changed in our crystals. Are you guys excited to see what these crystals are gonna look like after seven days? Yeah! yeah. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button down below. Hello friends, today this is how they look like and this is day two. This is what they look like. What are we looking at here, Sharon? Do you see any changes? No major changes. Looks like the pink one has kind of changed a little bit. Yeah, because it has two apart. Um, looks like there might be a. Oh, it looks like the green one is oh, perfect. The green one looks like it's changing. How about the blue? Mm, I don't see anything different with the blue. And the yellow is still about the same, too. Day three, guys, and this is what they look like. Yellow looks so the same. Ooh, the green looks really cool. <gasps> it's crystal! Not sure what's going on with the pink. And still no change on the blue. I think the green one's going to do it first. The green one's going to look pretty cool, I think. Five, this is what they look like. Well, the green one is really glowing. The pink one is growing a little bit. Look at the yellow one. And finally, the blue. The green one is really crystallizing. And the pink's starting to grow too. I think the pink is going to be the next one to grow. Schroeder. All right, so in real time, it's been about seven days. So it's been about a week since we started growing our crystals. So here, it's been our, our crystals. Now you can kind of see our green one here was really, really successful. The yellow and the pink um, were okay, and then the blue one was really success or was really unsuccessful there. So it really didn't uh, it really didn't take off at all. So I think what happened with the blue one was that we didn't really mix up the uh, crystals all that well, and I think with the green one we really, really mixed up the uh, we really, really mixed up the crystals really, really well. So what we're gonna do now. Uh -huh is the kit actually came with a base, with a base that lights up. Uh-huh, and, and then we can put our crystals on there, yep. and we can turn it on, mm -hmm. and they glow. All right. We got our green crystal here. We'll put it, how about we put this one in the middle? That, that one looks like the best, doesn't it? Yep, it does. 
Mm -hmm. The yellow one kind of looks like the second best here. Mm -hmm. Don't break it, Shire, but what does it feel like? It's crystal. Like, is it pointy? Uh-huh, pointy. Okay, now we'll put the yellow one up there. Uh, yeah. Ooh, the yellow one looks kind of... Like, it didn't grow, but it kind of crystallized on the bottom there. Okay. On the top. We'll put our pink one in there. You yeah. can kind of see our, see our pink one there. A weird one. And then we got our Weird. good old one. Yeah. Don't really know what in there. Okay, so let's see. Let's turn this on and see how these light up. What do you think of the crystal experiment? Cool. Now should we light it up? All right, Shire, can you hit right. the switch, please? Yep. <gasps> oh. So you know what? Maybe the green oh, one kind of grew a little bit out of control. The, got glowing. the pink one and the yellow one the look like they. Glowing. It looks like they kind of fit right in where they're supposed to be. So yeah, the yellow and the do. pink one, and then the green one just kind of, just kind of. This explored. one went wild, but it looks kind of cool. Yeah. I wish so. I wish the uh, blue one would have grown because I bet you it would have looked really really pretty looked in the really light. Cool. But hey, did you guys have fun doing this? Yeah. Hey, what do you guys think of our first kind of big experiment? Our science experiment. Was that neat? Good. All I right. think this was a really fun toy. Oh. And I, I have to say, as a family, we really enjoyed checking on the crystals every day and seeing how much they grew. Yeah. And this little display kind of makes it kind of special. We can put it somewhere and our crystals can can stay with us and, and glow in the dark and I bet you it's gonna look really pretty. So and maybe we can put it in my room. I bet you it'd be really pretty I in your room. It would be really cool. Okay. All different colors and maybe maybe we can mix another one and put it over this. Yes. Because there's only have... there was only four cups. Yep. But there are five places to put crystals. So maybe we can try again on the blue one. Yep, we can we can give and, that a shot. And, and we've do got some an orange. More. There's a few more different colors that we did not that's that right, I almost forgot. So we've got plenty of supplies to do this again if we want to. And that's that was kind of what was cool with this yep. um, kit that we got is that there's plenty to do a couple of times as a family and enjoy yeah. watching these crystals grow. So I hope you guys uh, liked doing this experiment with us. Thanks for watching our video and give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed watching these family experiments. Uh, we'll have, we're happy to do more of them. Uh, please subscribe to our channel and comment down below. And Great. almost hit the bell. Don't and forget to hit the bell. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace, Peace out. out.